Oh man, I made a mistake. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Are you ready for a video? Because I am. So as you can see from the thumbnail, the title of the video, this is Daddy Delp's top five glow plastics in disc golf. And I will put a little side note there the fifth one that's not really the best is probably going to be on that side of the lowest side in disc golf so i chose top five but you're really the top three are probably the one to look at but i went with five so let's go with it so uh when i did this i did a little time test for it so i will be putting uh pictures up probably towards the end so that you can see how these actually went checked it at two minutes all the way up to 20 minutes so I had some testing along with personal preference so that's just a little info for you so let's go ahead and get right into number five on the list of glow plastics so coming in at number five on this list it's a very popular company or at least has been in the past maybe uh, it's still really popular gonna be the Innova Color Glow uh, Tour Series plastic that they use it's the same stuff for like the Sextons all their Tour, tour Series uh, glow discs come in this Color Glow Star stuff I think is what it is or Champ Glow Champ whatever uh, I think this one might be Star I don't know you guys let me know if you know but yeah I, I'm, I can't remember I think there's a color glow champ and a color glow star. So this plastic, it has a really nice glow to it. It really does. The downfall of this plastic to me is its longevity. This plastic has a really nice initial bright glow and then it really loses that glow very quickly. I mean, very quickly you will see at the end whenever I put my little time uh, things up but really nice looking glow whenever it first goes but it's like immediately it's probably I don't know if that's loud or not but immediately you see it go from a really bright to just instantly you can see it dulling pretty quick so that is why it comes in at number five and actually uh, if I did a tier list of the worst glow plastics, I mean this could go on there. It looks great, but it does not glow very long and generally with glow discs you're looking for nice look and also longevity because unless you're playing in just a wide open field in the dark, of course you might be able to see it for a long uh, and okay amount of time when it's really dark, but um if you're using this plastic, I would recommend you keeping that UV flashlight to find it. So, I mean, you can do that anytime anyways, but um, yeah, longevity is not that great. So number five, Innova Star Glow whatever plastic. The Star and the Champ are pretty close from my uh, experience in longevity. So coming in at number four, this one it's pretty good um, it's the prodigy ace line glow plastic this is the duraflex now the I don't think the older glow plastic that's from the other stuff was any better than this um, and I don't know if they have any new stuff that glows any better but this stuff has a decent glow um, it's not like an overwhelming like oh that's nice it's just like oh that glows the selling point for this one is that it doesn't get like this crazy bright but it will hold the glow that it gets for a pretty good amount of time so for the purpose this is not the best looking glow but it does hold a glow pretty well um for a good amount of time like it's this one started off as i was like that's not gonna last that long and it was already not quite as bright the pictures might not do it justice but um 
wasn't quite as bright as the others that I had but over time it ended up still glowing just as long basically just not as bright so this is one that it can hold a glow but the the pretty like ooh, that's really nice glowy bright is not on the radar it just is kind of like a, a, a it's, it's a it's a marathon runner um, it can last pretty pretty long it's just not overly bright so P model S uh, I said the disc name uh, the glow in Duraflex from Ace Line uh, Prodigy stuff I said words that's number four so now we're at number three and I was in an area where I didn't know exactly where I wanted to go I was going through discs I had that glowed I mean to be honest once you go start going through companies there's not a lot to choose from because there's more discs than there are companies and plastics so um, I came onto this one and it glows pretty good um, it's not the best but it does glow pretty good and it has a good longevity so this one's for you Steli I hope you're watching Lone Star Discs glow I mean this glow plastic one thing about it this one at least is insanely flexible but um, this holds a glow really long and it also is pretty bright compared to the others now Innova like I said is bright off the start and just loses it crazy fast this is probably close in brightness but holds it so much longer um, it's a nice look and the good thing that I like about this one at least um, against the prodigy is where this is kind of translucent see-through the rim glows really bright compared to the flat plate the flat plate the flat plate the flat plate still bright but you get a long glow out of this rim and I guess it's because there's so much more uh, plastic right here uh, you get a better glow and it lasts longer but it's still uh, what I was finding what it seemed like was the plastic uh, right here that was glowing in the middle on the flat plate was close to the same brightness as the Prodigy um, and was about the same duration but the rims brighter on this one for much longer um, so that was a difference between the Prodigy and this one is that this one has a brighter glow overall but the flat plate eventually gets really similar to the Prodigy in glow but they held very similar in time maybe this one lasted maybe a little bit longer uh, to be honest I didn't let them sit the whole time till they stopped glowing because that would have been hours um, except for the end of a but um, eventually this one was still a little bit brighter Lone Star Disc they got a pretty good glow so now we're getting down to the wire on the top glow plastics um i will say this <laughs> i said it so i will say this the plastic i picked maybe both of them for the first and second are potentially second generations so um my number two is obviously it's glow So this is the Moonshine Plastic that Westside Discs, Dynamic, all these, uh, all the Trilogy companies puts out. What I'm going to say is, I think this is the new Moonshine. If anybody knows, let me know. I'm pretty sure they have new blend of Moonshine, and I think this is the new Moonshine. The old Moonshine. It has a decent duration, but is not bright that was the thing with old moonshine plastic it was really hard to charge up with at least a flashlight and stuff but it would hold the charge for a little bit but it was just very faint 
So that was the thing. It was hard to charge up old moonshine. This stuff is bright. So um, looking at this, this one is very similar uh, to the Lone Star Discs in brightness and duration. These both were about going at the same rate. So I think I liked this one a little bit better. It was just a little bit brighter. I liked the feel of this plastic better. Not quite as translucent. It still is translucent, not quite as translucent. So the flat plate has maybe just a touch more glow to it. But the brightness that they both get to are the same. The duration of their uh, glow was the same. So um, I'm placing this one at number two just because that flat plate and the feel of the plastic is just a little bit better. So now we'll move on to the King of Glow. So I'm sure most people know. MVP, the gyro, uh, not the gyro freaks, the, the reactor loving, I don't know what I'm saying. Over mold. Eclipse, I'm pretty sure this is Eclipse 2.0. I've not had old Eclipse. This is stuff here is crazy bright they also have a blue glow as well that is really good this stuff though just glows like the sun i'm pretty sure this disc was charging the others while it was glowing and then on top of it being the brightest glow it also was glowing that brightest the longest it was I feel like I could have let this just sit in a dark room for 24 hours, went back, and it would still be glowing more than the Innova stuff was after three minutes. They know what they're doing when it comes to glow and putting it in their plastics. There's not much else to say about that. So that's your number one. Out of every every category, overmold, glow, MVP Eclipse 2.0 that is the best glow plastic you're gonna get so we'll start it off I'll put a picture here probably so this was at two minutes everything was kind of close uh, Innova was the obvious not winner and at this point the Eclipse 2.0 was pretty much standing out as like hey I am the shining star so now we're going to move to four minutes, I believe it was. And that's when you started seeing a big drop off with Innova, basically. And then Prodigy, you could see it wasn't quite as bright as the others. Um, I'm not looking at these pictures, so I'm hoping I'm getting this right. Um, Lone Star and the other um, Moonshine Plastic were basically the same. And the gyro is still shining like a star. So then we go to around 10 minutes, 9 minutes, 10 minutes. And I think at this point in time, Innova is basically just not glowing. Um, but Prodigy is pretty much shining how it has been. And the others are getting closer on their flat plates to what Prodigy looks like. I think their rims are still a little bit brighter. But the flat plates are very similar. And like I said, the gyro stuff still just shining like crazy. It starts getting more obvious that it's gonna last for a while. And then I think I went to like 15 minutes and maybe 20. So if I have two more pictures, they'll go right here. It'll be 15, then 20. And at that point in time, you were starting to see the uh, discs losing their glow, but the gyro Eclipse 2.0 was still shining like crazy. Um, the moonshine was doing pretty good uh, and Lone Star was doing pretty good. Prodigy was losing its glow some, but the story stays the same. It's just, you can't beat Eclipse 2.0 for glow around. If you're gonna have an all glow bag, I have to say, um, no man, I made a mistake. I'm back. The mistake I made 
was I forgot about a glow plastic. Let me explain. I was going through my house looking at all the glow plastics I had, thinking I had everything here. All my RPM stuff is in my truck. I forgot about the RPM plastic because it wasn't in front of me. I redid some of this. And I will say, RPM's glow plastic does glow pretty bright. And it has a, a pretty decent longevity. I, I'm going to be honest, I only uh, checked on it after about 10 or 11 minutes. It was still glowing. Now, it wasn't as bright as the other plastics, but I will tell you it was brighter than one. And that was Innova. So what we're going to do here is uh, the end of this video is going to be saying the top six glow plastics in disc golf because I will show you the pictures. I've got some pictures of this glowing. Uh, it was obvious this glows brighter than Innova longer. So what I'm doing is I'm going to push Innova to six, put RPM's glow plastic in uh, the glow atomic in at number five because I don't think it glows it's it's pretty close it it glows brighter than prodigy but I don't know that it glows longer brighter if that makes sense it still slowly loses its glow but just at a longer amount of time than Innova and prodigy just wasn't ever as bright as this one but it kept that consistent glow for a very long time so we'll keep it like that we'll put rpm's atomic glow it's a really good bright glow and it'll it lasts over 10 minutes i just didn't test up to the 20 because i was literally at the end of this video when i had the uh, that moment so whoops that's what happens when you keep every one of the discs in your truck of the company that you sponsor by you start looking for video ideas and then if you're my age you forget this is a good plastic i love this is one of my favorite plastics by the way atomic and the atomic glow is really nice so it might not glow the the brightest or the longest but it glows pretty good it's better than uh, a few companies so that is it. That is the top six glow plastics in disc golf. Um, let me know what you think. If I missed a glow plastic that is really good, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know some ideas. It's raining here, so I didn't have any other content right now to put out, so I shot this video. Uh, I have some other stuff planned, and uh, make sure you check in on us every Sunday. This coming Sunday, we'll be on Basinger's channel for the... Uh, whole discussion podcast then the following sunday we'll be over here on this channel for just hucking around disc golf podcast make sure you keep checking in on the channel we got more stuff coming as the year goes but yeah let me know your thoughts on glow plastic and disc golf that's all we got till next time peace